that's had this kind of impact. Not off. Eric Williams Jr. with the steal to the rack. Layup is good. And the foul. With a chance to tie, it's Eric Williams Jr. Frankie Hughes back up top to Cincinnati Carey. Carey will drive left side. Over to Lamar Norman, who's checked in for three. It's good. Duquesne ties it up. Toppin comes out of the game. Trey Landers checks in for Dayton. Frankie Hughes from the left wing. It's good. And how about that? Swing. Williams Jr. try to get a spin move there. The ball gets knocked out to Tavian Dunmartin. Floater no good, but there's Eric Williams to clean it up. Landers lobbing it into Toppin. It didn't go in. Couldn't get the lob slam to go. Back comes Dunmartin. Frankie Hughes, top of the key for three. Banks it in. Banks are open. <laughs> <laughs> Leads haven't, haven't caused them to panic. They've been able to actually stay calm and chip away at it, but it's been a little bit more of the opposite today. Weathers driving the baseline. Up and under reverse layup, and that cuts it to five. Well, that's what I'm talking about. Gary looking to chip into this lead. Spin move, works into the corner. Norman for three. Got it. Four point game. Well, how about Sincere Carey, his ability to call for a clear out. Duquesne leads by nine. Just over five minutes left in regulation. Sincere Carey trying to drive the lane. Over on the right wing, Norman for three. Got it. Lamar Norman does it again, his third three-pointer of the game. And we got a six-point game now, Coach. But he really, he never worries about a missed shot. He goes up and gets his own, and, and you really appreciate that. Williams for three from the right wing. And the lefty puts it in. He cuts it to seven.